Okay, the PhotoStress equipment, first of all, PhotoStress is the name of the equipment that Vache makes. So this is referred to as the PhotoStress system. But the, the concept of stress analysis based on the refraction of light, based on the amount of strain in an object, is referred to as photoelasticity. And here's the, the physics behind it. So most polymers, plastics, as you send light through them, the light and the way it is refracted, so its index of refraction, changes as the material is strained. So this system has a set of polarizing lenses which are necessary to take advantage of this fully. Uh, takes advantage of that changing index of refraction. So if you look at a, a part that has been stressed such that there is strain displacement in it, and we can look at those patterns of light and take those patterns of light and do calculations to determine what the strain is and from there determine what the, the stress is. These particular samples that I have here are just plastic, but the idea is that you take and you coat the part that you're interested in with a material and you strain that part and then look at the color patterns. So normally you have what's called a structure and a plastic. So the structure gets coated with that plastic. And again, that's what you're putting into an Instron machine, for example, and pulling on it. Today we have just a plastic, no structure, but that's okay. We're gonna look at the changing light pattern in the plastic itself with no structure to reinforce it. On the back side of the, of the plastic is a reflective material because we want to be able to um, reflect that light back and capture it with the video camera. For the particular tests that you're going to do with your, with your labs, it's a total of four tests. You're going to use these two samples and you're going to be pulling on them and you're also going to be bending them. So you're going to support here and here and you're going to apply a load here, so a four point bend scenario, and we're going to apply bending to it. So again, total of four different scenarios. To start off with, I'll set up the machine for tension. So we've got this piece here, we'll place in the bottom. And I'm going to take the spring out of the bottom. We don't need that. Set that right there. We want the slot running this way. In fact, why don't, why don't you do it so that on Tuesday, as you're showing them, you'll be familiar. So, Goche, do you want to go ahead and put that one in? And the pin for it is, I think I set over here somewhere. It's not, it's gonna be like that. <laughs> well, the pin... Yeah, right, and I set the pin, is it, where did I just set the pin? Huh. Oh, here it is, I'm sorry. Okay, so there's the pin for that. Okay. And then here's for the, the top, and a smaller pin for that, so that goes in here. Mm-hmm. There's a pen. This clip is a little harder to get on there. It just it's small and so yeah. Actually it's it's a little harder to get off than to get on. Just a <coughs> it's just a clip. It's just a clip. Okay. So when we take it off, why don't you take it off and then when we do the bending? Okay. Okay, at this point. What you'll want to do is you'll want to raise this up because the sample that we're going to do first, uh, we'll do this one first, needs to fit between that hole and that hole. So go ahead and raise it up. Yeah, right. So we'll set those. You can just lift it up for now and then we'll set them uh, when we get to that point. So let's see here. 
Now there are these two little dowel pins. Actually, it's you're gonna have to come back down. There's a pin that we'll place through here. And let's see where we are down here. Looks like we are perfect. Okay. Now it's it's loose. That's okay. That's all right. It, it's going to pull on it and it'll tighten everything. Up. Nope, no, that's it. That'll that'll be it. Now at this point, what you can do is we'll we'll pull on it a little bit, but let's go open up the program first, and then we'll go from there. So. Yeah, so you can finish this and you can open up a new, this, there are two programs, one for tension, one for bending. Okay. So they'll have to switch back and forth. That's okay, just hit finish. Yeah, you have to do it like three times, it's annoying. It'll ask you if you wanna save and you can say no.